you know, people don't like Rick and Dow. They want to get him out of boxing. They don't. They, they don't want to see him. First, they're gonna say that he had a, uh, a cheap chat like Mayweather. This was not no cheap chat. I mean, this is boxing, man. You keep your hands up. Rick and Dow is the best, man. I, I want to see this guy fight. Every single day he gets on the chance on TV. This guy shows a sweet science of boxing. Who don't like no shit like that? But hey, you know what? Nowadays, they don't like him. They don't like him. They just want to see two guys bang it out, bang their heads out, bring their brains out to the point where they can't talk no more. They have an eye problem, surgery problems. They want all that type of problems. And then, then they can't be... Then... Then they can't box in the late features like Benah Hawkins. Benah Hawkins never took damage. That's why he's fighting all the way until he's 50. But now they want two people bang it all out, bring their brains out to the point where when they get up and up a little bit up in age in 30 to 40, they can't fight no more. That's why I like Rigadow, man. Rigadow shows the sweet signs of boxing. I mean, Rick and Dow, man, if he can fight every single day, hey, if he was on pay-per-view, I'd buy all his fights. That's how I'm going. I love the sweet signs of boxing.